Um, are we back? <laughs> I think I'm back. I think I'm back. The power of Turel is too strong. They had to delete it from the game because he would like crash every single internet connection inside of IOS. I'm spinning like a ballerina. Uh, no, don't open Mega. Let's see. Let me see if I can. First of all, Rasil, if you see in the chat, can you please confirm that we're back? Because I don't know if we are. Did the Varga, the Varga split? The Varga split. I hate when the Varga split like this because I need to patch it up together again. I hate it. It happened again, but this time OBS didn't crash. This time around, the string crashed. I don't know what was up with that. We're back? Okay. Cool. But yeah. Uh, what else can we look that won't spoil the fuck out of me? <laughs> I wonder. Boy, no way, boy. Boy, no way, boy. Boy, no way. Well, I mean, this is a meme, actually, I want to show. Raciel looks at his past. Everything is a spoiler. I spoiled myself. Son of a fucking gun. Um, uh, fuck! I can't look anything without spoiling me. I want to look at me at a meme. Uh, Raciel is born in Latin America. Yeah, I want to look at me. Oh, oh my goodness! This is one. I need to show this. This is this actually is absolutely perfect. And yeah, yeah. Be careful to spoil yourself, Nero. Booba. Why is there Booba on my YouTube feed? I'm looking at. I can't be distracted by Booba. I'm. I must defeat Kane. Uh, Rassi, uh Soul River meme. This is one... Oh, this cosplay is fantastic. This is one meme that I watched a while ago. Which, like, shows the... Well, that's nice. People have been doing animations for a while now for Soul River, and they are fantastic. Oh, boy, I can't find it. This is one meme that I really like about Soul River that uh it's not a spoiler because it shows one of the scenes from from Soul River 1 in which Raziel looks like his past slash future and it shows like a little Raziel twerking for some reason and Raziel is just like there crying I don't know what was done with that Oh yeah, there's like um, amazing, beautiful animations here of different events in Soul River 1 and 2. I'm gonna watch that, that one later, actually. Oh, actually, we're gonna watch this one now. Okay, let me check. Yeah, th thank you, Stream Elements. Uh, nothing... Okay, nothing saucy here, okay. You can see. I allow you to see. Accept your calling, Raziel. You are deformed. I am deformed. And you are ugly. And I am ugly. <laughs> Poor Raziel. Oh yeah, Mandarin Grayman did a... Did a anime shit. Uh, did a... Oh, uh, don't look at that. <laughs> don't look at that. I knew, I knew it. I knew, I fucking knew it, man. <laughs> God damn it, man. Oh. <laughs> no, you didn't say nothing. Raphael, you didn't say nothing. Anyways, enjoy this animation by Sakusagi. Uh, which I love. It, it Stuff like this. Memes are powerful, man. Like, memes show accolades and numbers in on the internet. And that shows interest in the game and the franchise. So, 
if people make more memes and shit like this, and more shit posting, or beautiful stuff like this, uh, it actually tells Emb um, Embracer Group, yeah, we want another freaking Soul River, even though we've been telling them for like almost 15 years. Well, not we, like people, you know? I'm fairly new to this. Also, I love the the size accuracy here because Kane is fucking towering over Raziel. Okay, let, let me be extra careful here. Here, here's the problem with me enjoying PC ninety eight OSTs. The PC ninety eight is fucking filled with uh, you know what? Because it, it's a it's a, a computer from Japan and a bunch of people anyone could make a PC ninety eight game. If you had to know how they on programming and like art, anybody could make a visual novel. So naturally what people did is, you know, what sells the most. If you know what I mean. Okay, chocolate pudding. Uh I think we're good. Yeah, we're good. Excuse me for being precisely and extremely anal about this, but I don't want to get banned. Okay, this video is very quiet. Give me a second. 17.5. I still the mods, I understood it. Cats? Ah, let's, let, yeah, let's, let's say that. Let's say that's cats, yeah. Sure. Or I still my most innocent boy. You don't have no, I have no idea. Sorry for assuming, by the way. Focus of magics. In an instant. My mind was flooded with torturous visions of all that had led me to this abysmal state of- No! Nope. I forgot, this video has spoilers. Wait a minute, that's more obvious, that's all we need to know. That's all we need to know the volume of this. God damn it man, I need to play every single one of these games now. So I can look at the memes without getting spoiled. Just, just gotta, you, gotta, you gotta do this. Okay, I think we're good. Look at this. Fucking beautiful. It was a video game, but the implementation three was safe. Good. A huge one. Oh, okay, I better, I better not. I'm planning to play every single game in the franchise. I don't know about streaming them because streaming Legacy of King games is a little bit of a hassle. Every single one of the games that I played in the Legacy of King, as in two. The has been extremely, extremely difficult to set up. You have no idea. Uh, but yeah, uh, let me hit this again. <laughs> you never know what you're just going to come up with, so let me be extra careful here. Uh, Soul River Chocolate Pudding. PCX, PCSX 2 emulator is good for Soul River 2. I'll have to check it out because... Last time I tried to emulate in PlayStation 2, uh, it wasn't pretty. Yeah, I tried to play Budokai Tenkaichi 3, but it wasn't pretty. Okay, this one is a spoiler-free version of the meme. I knew. Yeah, you knew, Kane. I know you knew. Uh, let me show you all this. Black hour this was, as foretold by Mobius himself. That snake had made it clear to me what this might portend. I beheld Raziel, awake, with no explanation for his state. Raziel, what dark pacts have you allowed yourself to become entangled in? I am compelled ineluctably to create a concoction of chocolate, a dessert fit for mortals. It's four hours past midnight, Raziel. What could possibly possess you to craft chocolate pudding at this ungodly hour? Because I cannot escape my destiny. There you go. I just have one person getting a crash on it and it happened only once. Here's the thing about that. I'm sure the emulator's great. 
and I'm sure it runs perfectly and all that. But you gotta understand, I'm streaming from a laptop and it's not like top notch. It's not like the best. It's a great laptop, but it's not the best. And it works fantastically, actually. It ha yeah, and for like schoolwork and homework and shit like college and shit like that and work, it has worked fantastic. But when it comes to streaming, I'm fairly limited by what I can stream. Juegos que necesitan un remaster. Yeah, they are. A lot of people like to talk about Soldier. That's a good cosplay. Ooh, okay. That, this, I'm gonna give a like to this. Check out NCOMB. Z with a, a Z. Because, like, goddamn. To pull off a, a successful Rassia, cosplay you need to be extra skinny because he actually doesn't have a body. There's Soul River on the PS1. Oh, and then we start getting recommended stuff. There's Dragon Ball. I'm good. Uh, okay. Hey, this is what happens with YouTube Shorts. After a while, they start recommending you stuff. And I don't care about any of this, but because I'm already tangled in the algorithm, I'm just going to keep going. That's what happens. But yeah, the fuck do I do now though? Because like the objective was to finish Soul River, but I didn't think it would take me only two hours and a half. I thought it would take me like three. Oh, give me a second. I'm going to get into just chatting here real quick. Hello. Um, any suggestions? Brazil. I do have, hold on. I could do a little bit of research in the meantime. I put some music. Give me a second. PC Gaming Wiki uh, Soul River 2. PC Gaming Wiki is really good for this because it actually tells you all the best, like. Oh. Okay, I can show you this. Okay, so PC Gaming Wiki says uh, there are, there's some recent patches from SR2, but I didn't check any. Okay, it has low compatibility with modern systems, which is great, but you know, it's not the first time this has happened with Soul River or Legacy of Kin in general. Random crashes, apparently it's fixed. We'll see about that. Uh, I already bought this on GOG. DRM free. Uh, so we have to we have to check it out. But at least well, it's gotta be somewhat playable since you can buy it, but you know. But there's a demo available, but well, too bad I already bought the game. Let's see. Essential there improvements. There's patch 1.02. Data distribution versions are already patched, and so this patch out in new versions of Windows from that as an administrator. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna have to Make sure to do this. Give me a second. I hope the audio is alright. I hope you can hear me. Or okay. Soul Fixer fixes crashes related to audio, mm -hmm. resolution switching, and the Bink video player. Oh, that's why I use this Bink video player. Well, it restores motion blur to improve the effect, replaces blah, 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 and supports for aspect ratio at any resolution. That's going to be interesting because we might be able to play this in 16 by 9 aspect ratio with that. I wish I could disable motion blur. I'm someone that doesn't really like it. It makes me weird. It makes me feel like dizzy. But yeah. That's compatibility with direct input and X input controllers. Does that include PS4 though? I don't know. Uh, extra setup dialogue options. Dialogue options. Okay. Uh, and it has a bunch of options, like the stuff like 
Uh, it doesn't have skin cloud, but it has like GOG Galaxy like stuff. White screen, blah blah blah. Looks like Soul Fixer is the way to go. But yeah, it seems like it's gonna take more than a little bit of trouble. I don't wanna say effort, it's gonna be trouble. Because like the effort is to just install a patch, and the trouble is going to be to make it work. You cannot control the music, bruh. Come on. It's a game on the PS2. Do, 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 da, 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 ba, da, ba, ba, da, ba, da, ba, 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 Uh, and it's, uh, it has the Spanish version done. That's good. It's in French, and Italian, Russian. I didn't play the Spanish version as a kid. I was sort of one because, again, I didn't have a... A European PS1. I had a, an American one. VR support? Or what? Soul River 2. Okay, it looks like Soul Fixer fixes a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, the system requirements like required in Windows 98 and Windows Millennium. And so then it's like. Only one gigabyte, what? Guys, I don't know if my processor is better than an Intel Premium 3, 450 megahertz. I don't know. What the heck? So I follow Windows Vista, blah, 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 blah. I follow the server Windows Dexter, okay, whatever. While trying to play Soul River 2 will may likely have problems on the additional cutscenes, so maybe just watch the cutscene on YouTube before trying to set up the game. I'll keep that in mind, thank you. Hold on, let me check. How much is... Maybe I can install it now. And see, like, without the patch, without anything, to see how it works. Well, let me go into GOG. Because it's crazy how much trouble this series is giving me. It, so far, it's been worth it. Let's see, what's the... Okay. PC Gaming Wiki... Blood Omen 2. What's the, what's the deal with that? Let's see. Do, 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 do. Also, Castlevania 4 music really, really works with uh, the vibe here. I should play it one day. It will suck to get problems in the cutscene and ruin the experience, that is true. No, this is in a new device in GOG Galaxy. I installed you here for the first time. I know I haven't used you in a while. Used you in a while. But fuck. Uh, lacks some effects from the Xbox and PlayStation 2 versions. Low compatibility, one more senses. We need a, a full re release of every single one in the every single game in the Soul River and Legacy of Camp franchise because, like, every single one of these fucking. Games like, has problem with modern systems. They like modern as in Windows 7 and up. Defiance is the only one working. Look, I yeah, but I in a quitter. Just some control problems, I hate that. But there's probably some patch. Well they had the revamp patch. Well the the fans are going coming in clutch. <laughs> Once again. Another patch. Conceptual edition. Aims to restore cut content, solve various in game issues, retexture most of the characters, tweak in game elements, and bring FMBs from the PlayStation 2 version in high quality with fixed widescreen aspect ratio. Well, there are options here, that's good. Okay, let's see Defiance. Yeah, it looks like it doesn't have any problems. It has an unofficial patch. Oh, 
Okay, uh, looks like the Defiance is going to be the one that gives us the less trouble. Just like Raziel said. What about Nosgoth? It's not available. I know for a fact there's a Nosgoth. Nosgoth, a uh, private server. Yeah, there is a private server. No, don't open Twitter, Nero. You're gonna get banned. Hold on. Sorry, that was a. Uh... Let me check my Twitter real quick. That was that was stupid. <laughs> my Twitter is filled with very wholesome stuff. Oh, it wasn't something. It wasn't that bad, but you know, still. And uh, yeah, okay. Um, I don't know what to do now, honestly, because like, Soul River is gone and done. I can uninstall it now and get rid of all the issues that the Dreamcast emulator gave me. I'm probably gonna play more Dreamcast games, maybe not on stream, but uh, I'm definitely gonna check it out. Soul River Two, I'm not gonna install it right now because I need to install the. The patch and all that, and it's been like a whole bunch. It's a hassle, and I need to get ready for the D and D stream in a couple of days. So yeah, it's a bunch of shit. What else do I have here? Okay, let me go to just chatting real quick. Beneath every smart fella is a fart smell. Out. Let's see. We can sort of have on a piece one library. I have CTR, Elementor Gearbox, Lunoa, Kodelka, Low River, Dragoon, Sun Hills, Pirate, Dragon, and Sinogears, but I don't know. None of them are like <laughs> streamable right now. Uh, what is going on on Discord? Nothing. Okay. I should. I could probably just end the stream here because, like, the objective of the stream was to finish Soul River. I could play some damn well. I could play some Valhalla, but uh, I feel like I want to do that for in a couple of streams more when I stream Valhalla. Uh, Warcraft 3 is in Spanish, so it doesn't work. Banner of the Maid might have some bannable stuff. So, uh, that doesn't work. Let's see how it performs, actually. Give me a second. Hold on. Um, Soul Calibur. Dreamcast. I never played Soul Calibur myself, but... You know, we'll, we'll see what happens. It's only like 600 megabytes, so it should be easy to set up. CDI, I mean GDI. Let's enjoy the Pokemon music in the meantime. It's such a nice song too. Okay. Uh, this will take a while, but just a little while, while well, this downloads. Uh, but yeah, closing like thoughts on Soul River, I loved it, I fan it's fantastic, honestly. It, and I feel like what people feel about Soul River is completely justified, how it's supposed to be uh, a hidden gem of sorts. Like, people love it, Soul River. With all their heart, and I feel like I'm one of those people now. Even though I technically have been playing it for um, 20 years at this point, now it's the only time that I actually finished it.
<laughs> if this doesn't run well, I might just either play some down well, which is like my go-to filler stream, because then my cry three I uninstalled because it was getting stupid. Or I might just end the stream. Who knows? But uh, no, I want to stay here for a little while. It's fun. Dun, dun, dun. Oh yeah, I forgot. Bluff was here. Um, in a, a while ago. Let, let me give him a shout out real quick. Bluff's awesome. So yeah, go follow him. He streams retro horror. Bark, bark, bark. So a bunch of all games, a bunch of survival games, a bunch of horror games. I love really cool stuff, and the community in his streams is absolutely fantastic. It's always a treat. It's, it feels like home. You know what I mean? Hey, go follow the floor. I do it now while I install Soul Calibur in my totally original and completely not pirated uh, Dreamcast. <laughs> Uh, Soul Calibur, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, let's hope this works, actually. You know, I want to keep the, uh, the retro stuff intact. Soul Calibur. Just like my original Super Nintendo, yeah. Completely original. With all my games. Mm -hmm. I know a couple of people have, that have all these like retro consoles that are actually not emulators at all, Wink. I've been playing with emulators my whole life, so at this point it's, it's not really a, a problem for me. Especially since who the fuck has a Dreamcast today, you know? <laughs> that shit's that expensive. You have an original Game Boy Advance? Oh, that's cool. All I have myself is like, I have my PS1. My Wii, my 3DS, and my PS4. Well, I say my, but they're mine and my brother's. You know what I mean? But you know, at least three of those are retro. You could, could you consider like 3DS? I gotta fucking gush about retro stuff, stuff again. You could consider 3DS and the Wii to be retro since they're pretty freaking old. And they're not being produced anymore. And there's a whole bunch of games that are unaccessible unless you have those consoles. You also have a 3DS? Oh, that's cool. Did you hack it? Did you unlock your 3DS, which is surprisingly easy to do? Oh yeah, everyone check out my highlights. And on the chat, as well as my Twitter, if you want. You did? Oh, that's awesome. Me too. A bunch of emulators there as well. So whenever I go on a trip with my family, uh, I start playing like Mario RPG and stuff like that. I, I can't play PS1 games because apparently the 3DS is not that powerful to do that. But yeah, I also have a program to run like DS games and shit like that. It's awesome. But yeah, give me a second. Let me set up this real quick. Um, Gaming? Yeah, gaming. Because we're gaming. And hopefully this works. We're so... Um, Dreamcast BIOS. Oh, oh, I feel ya. This is in in documents. It's in documents. Documents. Uh, Flycast, ROMs, Low Caliber, and then select current directory. Done. And done. And that's Low Caliber. I play some hack some hack runs on the GBA on the 3DS. Like what, man? I want I mean I want more and more stuff to put on my 3DS. I played a bunch of games that I haven't finished, but <laughs> I always want to play something new. 
Okay, let's see if Soul Calibur works, actually. Soul Calibur is one of those things that I've always wanted to check out. The legend will never die. It requires 12 blocks of free memory to save game data. You can press the start button to create a Soul Calibur game data file. Okay. Namco. That is Namco. Well, at least the, the cutscenes are pretty. The game I played the most on the 3DS was Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate, yeah. I tried the Origin of Monster Hunter games, they weren't for me, honestly. Because I, I'm one of those people that started playing in World and Rise and stuff like that. The other ones were good, but very clunky. I feel you. Yeah, I tried them out, and maybe it was the the 3DS control, but I just couldn't. Cervantes, there is Cervantes. Have I played Solid on stream? I don't think I played Solid on stream. It's Maxi the boy. Soul Calibur. Here's the thing about Soul Calibur. It's such an Soul important. Calibur. Yeah. It's such an important piece of technology when it comes to fighting games because hopefully Battle it runs well. One, okay, it runs pretty well. Uh, first of all, my controller is designed and designed. It is configured to play Soul River, so that's going to be very interesting. Because, uh, like, the controls are weird. But anyways, as I was saying, it's such an important hallmark of fighting games, especially. Because this is one of the first fighting games that actually looked better on console than it did on... Uh, on the arcade. Which, at the time, was unheard of. Completely unheard of. And you saw from the... From the intro cutscene, it looks extremely pretty. For a game that came out in the late 90s. Okay. Yeah, like, I, I... Oh no, it has controller presets. Oh boy, that's gonna be interesting. Okay, let's go into training mode and see if the controllers work at all. But yeah, a lot of people have a... A lot of fondness for Soul Calibur. Personally, I haven't played it. Had to know now, see ya. Um, thank you for being here, Raziel. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed the the legacy of Kane Soul River. Hope to see you in Soul River 2 if it works. <laughs> that is. Take care of yourself. A lot of people did, had a lot of fun this for Soul Calibur. I haven't played it myself because, you know, I, I wasn't one of the two people in Chile that had a Dreamcast back in the day. You know, about 98% of the population who played video games had a PlayStation. Welcome back to the stage of history. Let's see. We're gonna try out. I'm sure there are more characters here that I can unlock later on, but we're gonna try out. 
Uh, Shanghua is pretty cool. My main name Soul Calibur is Talon, but Talon isn't here. I think she had got it in Soul Calibur 3? Or something like that? Yeah, we're gonna try out Maxi. The boy. And then it's gonna be Mitsurugi. Okay, let's try out the combos. The controls, that is. Maxi versus Mitsurugi. Fight! Is it that works? This is block. Mid. Okay, I'm, I'm doing this on the top of my head, by the way. Hold on. Okay, let's go in an arcade. I think it works properly, but you know, I might be missing. Soul Caliber. I might just be missing a few uh, buttons. Uh, let's go with Shangwa. Actually, I really like her style. Fight inside, that is. Oh, well, you're so weird. Let's go. Oh yeah, you can, you can just knock yourself out of the ring in this game. That's awesome. It runs fantastically well, even if um, I'm streaming at 30 and I'm playing the game at 60. Which is, I'm sure it's kind of secondly just for everybody. But you know, it is what it is. I've just been in models here, by the way. I never played this game ever. Uh, Shanghua, why are you speaking Japanese? I thought you were Chinese. That's weird. How do I throw? That's all I want to know. Well, I'm a monk, it's kind of, kind of goes with the same, but I'm, I really like characters that have a Chinese, like, martial arts or fighting style. I don't know why. Also, this, this game looks a particular kind of pretty, but it, like, only Dreamcast games looked like this back in the day. You know, a middle ground between PS1 and PS2. If you want to look at it that way. I'm definitely gonna be playing more of this off stream because this is really freaking fun. Not gonna lie, I played a little bit of Soul Calibur 6, but there's a rabbit on a sale. Get up, Yanghua. Please. <laughs> okay. I'm having fun now, by the way, but fighting games, especially during this time, were really unfair later on. Can't get away with how good the team was. God damn, by the way. I wish I had an original Dreamcast. So I can butcher it with my 16x9 display that I have in my room. I can just keep it though. Oh, that's bad. There you go.
I know there's net play to... What the heck are you doing, Killick? <laughs> I know there's net play on Soul Calibur 2 in some of the versions of the game. There's like an HD version of Soul Calibur 2 where you can play online. But it got released years ago for the PS3 or something. Also, they, they jump? Or... I'm gonna play... Oh, almost there. There you go. They jump from this. From Soul... Soul... From... Soul Edge. The Soul Calibur is immense. If you play that on console, that is. If you play that on arcade, it's not that big. But like I said, this thing was... Look, not... They look this pretty for arcades. Don't... Don't fall off the edge. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. This is making me want to try uh, Soul Calibur 6 again. Hey, yo! Okay, the, why are you lagging so much? You don't like the boat? Okay, don't look at the boat. I can lag. <laughs> okay, this this makes me this makes me really happy. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to stream a lot more Dreamcast games from now on. Come on, Ivy. Oh. oh, I got a block more. There you go. I wonder if I can get Netflix set up again. Oh, get someone here in the stream and play them. On Soul Calibur. I don't know if anybody plays Soul Calibur 1 specifically. I feel like people are a lot more fun of 2 because they have Link in it, for example. Or the modern games. But it's a shame. This game is pretty fun from what I'm playing right now. Gather Shangwa. Okay, there's a wild sending kick at I'm gonna spam that. I'm gonna I gotta. I'm oh, having so much fun, I'm sorry. Oh the knife, you look messed up, buddy. My pixel. God, I'm a master at this game now. Oh. oh.
Because you're so shangla. Come on. Oh. What the? The Soul River. Against Inferno. Okay, this one's gonna be interesting. Now, oh, how do I get? Out? I keep pressing buttons to get up quickly, like in Tekken, but that's not how it works at all. Maybe because this isn't Tekken. Could be. Weapons. Oh, that was a low. I was blocking. There's no way. Okay, this low parry is in this game, okay? You win. I insist, why are you talking? Why are you talking Japanese if you're Chinese, Jaffa? Ow. Okay, get out. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, like I said, fighting games in this era are, are kind of unfair than where you play them. They were crazy at the end. Ow. Oh, <laughs> you just charge up to kick me, man. Come on. Yeah, I need more practice with this game. Okay, Maxi. That's not, that's not fun at all. Hey, yo! Okay, almost one hit. One hit. There you go. The soul of you win. I, I would have loved, honestly, to have this game back in the day. Necrata Yuga she will reveal this true form as, as whatever. Um, they were talking on Brandon Strength and Return Shanghua channel her pure spirit through it. The inter interminable battle came to a close with Shanghai's victory. The brooding class that covered the firmament up until now broke apart to the real shaft of sunlight from above. Mother, was this the destiny I'm, I was meant to fulfill? She narrowed her eyes as the brilliant sunlight caressed her innocent, childlike face. 
She looks kind of tomboyish in this artwork, and that's pretty nice. Yay! <laughs> You're a true hero, and your legend will never die. But across the horizon, a new quest beckons your soul. Okay, that's nice. Oh, you already know my name, y'all. Let's see. Uh, what, what do I put here? And... Oh, you actually hit it. There you go. Where's the E? Uh... Sorry, uh... Nay. No, that's not it. <laughs> okay. Uh, where's the R? The local people doesn't know the fucking alphabet. Nero. The legend will never die. I'm dancing on it. Hwan Song Kyung. Okay. That's uh, the protagonist, quote unquote, of the first game. Okay, what is this? Play Soul Calibur with different mission goals. Mm -hmm. In the museum. Survival, classic, team battle, classic. Most of the most of the normal like Nanko fighting game stuff back in the day from Tekken. Welcome back to the stage of um, Okay, we try Shanghua. Shanghua is very fun to do. To use. Let's try out Damn, I started to calm down man. Uh Maxi. Grounds. You are in the deepest parts of the Himalayas. You are in search of an old man known as Edge Master. A man who has one mastered countless types of weaponry. Your goal is to train with this elder before embarking on your search around the world for the legendary soul sword Soul Age. Hmm, you have a hard journey ahead of you. The old man crosses his arms and falls silent in contemplation for a moment, and then begins to give your counsel on how to proceed on your journey. In order to travel the world in search of new battles, you must swim. First, prove yourself in battle. If the attacking the enemy is not always the correct path of achieving victory, blah blah blah. The rules are ready and this is a lot of lore. Once you emerge victorious on your battle, you can earn points when you can select art gallery from the map screen. Blah blah blah. Okay, old man, give me... It was just a guard move to protect yourself from the enemy's attacks. Where's the A button to guard? Um... Okay, let's save here, <laughs> just in case. Welcome back to the stage of history. Um, how do I move? Proving grounds. Okay, where do I move here? Oh, there you go. Edge master. Oh, you're an old man. I love your beard, though. Maxi. <laughs> Oh, that's the voice of Heihachi. That's a throw, man. I'm supposed to guard that? <laughs> also, it feels really good to move in this game. What the? Hey. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> that's enough. Let's do one. I love this. So I'm gonna. <laughs> Let me double chill a little bit because this game is kind of crazy. Uh, time attack, team battle. A second control is necessary. I need to find something. I'm gonna. I'm gonna drag my brother into this and play with him because, like, this is crazy fun. Uh, looks like. If Dreamcast Simulation is in, is in the question, we might be able to fire, to fire up a couple of Dreamcast games for the stream. I might do like a, a Dreamcast like showcase, kind of like the way I did with the, uh, the PlayStation One gallery I did a while back. But yeah, give me a second. Uh, let me check my phone. I haven't taken a break in this whole freaking time. I should probably do that. But I feel like uh, oh, Goosey's live. Yeah.
I have to go look at his channel. Uh, give me a second. Let me check something real quick. All right. Yeah. Um, this is great because like I, now I know that I can play Dreamcast games on stream and it seems to perform fairly, fairly well. So I'm going to have to find some Dreamcast uh, hidden gems, quote unquote, that I can check out. This is definitely one of them, although this isn't hidden at all. Everybody knows Soul Calibur. Or everybody did know Soul Calibur back in the day. I don't know about now. Give me a second. Um, Soul Calibur. Soul Calibur. Oh, it just went live. Okay. Okay, we're gonna play one more, one more arcade mode of Soul Calibur because this is way too fun, and I uh, I need to. I I need it. I need it in my life. I'm willing to invest money into a Dreamcast. Honestly, Can't Hold was very fun. Maxi, it's just a, it just arrived, you know, but. Let's try Huang. He's a Korean swordsman, I believe. <laughs> oh, Bordo, why are you wearing? Not much. Wait, is this just... Is this the same? No, it's not the same host but that move was like 10 plus. What I know about Flying is that in, in Soul Calibur 6, he shows up with like a black outfit and he looks like he's straight out of Bloodborne. So, yeah. Yeah, these are alternate outfits, these are not the canon outfits. Save yourself from what, dude? You're, you already destroyed her in battle, god damn. Alright, pretty boy, let's go. The kicks are so fun, they have... One has like quite on pack one domain, just... Like this, some of these are straight from where I smoke to in pack and three, like this, for example. No, I wanted to, I wanted to throw it, there you go. Why again? I really wish the characters talk their their native languages. I think I is European. I don't know why. I don't know why I think that. I think I said it before, but I love characters that have the 
the Chinese, like most of it. And a lot of moves that Hawaii has seem to be kind of similar to Shanghua's. I know Shanghua, Shanghua might be Korean then. Maybe I'm talking mad shit and she's in Chinese. She's Korean, actually. If that's the case, I apologize. It's such Well, yeah, Juan was added in the in the original one. Oh my god, that outfit is so pretty. Let me see that. Oh my goodness. I should have chosen that one. There you go. I don't know how just talks shit. Like, come on, they can be better than that coin. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm having way too much fun here. Also, other characters are very pretty. Even Boldo and his Winston Glass. Also, I don't know how I, how I feel about Maxi being blonde in this, in this color, honestly. Oh. Final battle, fight! That's right. There you go. I'm gonna take the time to actually learn and get good at this game because it's very very fun. Yeah, 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 Juan, just block the demon. Just block him. Juan against Inferno. Oh yeah, he's pretty boy now. Oh my god, I just realized something. Dreamcast works, I'm gonna be play I'm gonna be playing Marvel 2 on stream. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna be so much hype. I fucking love Marvel 2. I my wife to realize that. Marvel 2, baby. One legend spoke of the Sword of Salvation as being in truth and evil. Sword that draws souls insane. That's the solid. Enter during a fight with Inferno, the reincarnation of the sword, Mina, came to his aid. Oh, Mina. You can avail on me now. Indeed. Thank you. We did not rely on legends anymore, for we shall protect our country ourselves. The Celeste Patriots depart for the seas, of one rest to protect their country and their people. The stories will surely be retold with pride for future generations. Yay! 
Berlin chain will never die. But I didn't unlock anybody. Um, my name is. New Wolf. The legend will never die. Oh! Yoshimitsu. Okay. Uh, 10 points. Yeah. I'm definitely gonna look at more and more Dreamcast games to stream because this is, this is really freaking fun. And the Dreamcast is such an, uh, a whimsical and like mysterious thing for me because I didn't have a green a drink as growing up because you know I wasn't rich. <laughs> My family wasn't rich either. And the Dreamcast was the most expensive console at the time, I believe. At least here in Chile. And you know, I knew maybe one or two people who had a 64 back in the day, but the majority of guys had a, a PlayStation 1. Like the huge majority. So a Dreamcast on Chile is unheard of. So I'm definitely looking forward to look at some of the most popular games on Dreamcast here on stream one day. Very, very soon actually, because I'm actually really excited now. But yeah, uh, let me get back to just chatting for a second. Uh, lower the volume of the music a little bit. I kind of heard that one already, buddy. Don't you have something new? Yes, I do, actually. Speaking of Marvel, and Marvel too. All right. Uh, thanks, everybody, who can go stream. A couple of things I'd like to mention before we end. Uh, we finished Soul River today. And hopefully, we'll be able to play Soul River more in a couple of weeks. And thanks to you, Brazil, for being here and believing in me, even though I am an uh, overthinking dummy. When it comes to puzzle games. Uh, but yeah. I truly do appreciate it. And thank you Fluff for coming around to lurk around and talk about cats. Hmm. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I always love when you show up on my streams. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to catch more on your streams later on. As well. Everybody remember check me out on Twitter. On YouTube as Neuronomics on both of them. On Twitter, a bunch of, I post a bunch of dumb shit, as well as notifications on the stream, and I follow a lot of cool people, mostly YouTubers, and a lot of art. And on YouTube, I post highlights, shorts, and as well as uh, bots. All the bots that you see here on Twitch are later on, put, posted on the YouTube for posterity's sake, because on Twitch, they get deleted. You know how it is. But yeah, we're gonna be raiding Goosey right now, he's, he's streaming. So give me a second. What's Goosey's name again? Goosey Goblin. Oh yeah. Since he's been kind enough to me for <laughs> just being around, honestly. And he's been on the stream a couple times. Uh, so yeah. Anyone here says... Uh, hi to Goosey, the rain message, I don't have one, so just be nice, follow the rules, you know that, don't be stinky. And I hope you had a fantastic time on the stream, I'm gonna be gone for a couple of days, and then we're gonna do a D&D stream in which I create a character rolling for every single stat, race, class, and all that. And the only objective will be to not make a Tiefling Monk a Saba, we kinda made one already. But yeah, I'll see you all on the next stream, in a couple of days. See ya. Where's the bottom? There it is.